What's up everybody? It's your boy Jack Rabbit here. Hopping in with another Power Ranger Lightning Collection video. And this time we will be looking at... Uh, I want to say... I'm going to say what's in the box, but then I'm going to go into Preach for a second. Which is In Space Power Rangers In Space Phantom Ranger. Okay, I have an issue with this. Big issue. Okay. First of all, they package it with him with a weapon. Now, I don't can't remember if he had his own personal weapon or not. Sorry, I can't remember. It's been too long since I watched Turbo all the way through. Especially the parts where Phantom Ranger's in it. Because that's where they bring in the new cast and I kind of fall off a little on it. But I can't remember if he had his own personal weapon. But you package him with a version of the Turbo Navigator. Which is a Power Ranger Turbo Weapon. Okay. And get this. I looked this up to prep for this video. Just to get on my high horse for a second. And then I'm going to go into story time and then we'll continue. He was in Hasbro. This is a way to pay attention. Okay. He was in seven episodes of Power Rangers Turbo. Seven. Okay. Seven. I can't really do seven. Sorry. He was in... Three of in space. And that's counting countdown to destruction. So, I say he's more of a turbo character than an in space character. I'm just saying. Way to pay attention, Hasbro. But, that's me getting on a high horse. Now it's time for funnies and stuff like that. Sorry, I had to get on a high horse for a quick second there. Um, sorry, continuity issue. Bugs me. Okay. But it is funny. Way to go to continuity. And if you guys see my previous video, I reviewed In Space Pink, which is Cassie. The funny part about this is now, it's not like point blank that they had a thing for each other, but it's implied that In Space Pink and Phantom had a thing for each other without seeing each other. They had a little budding romance. That they never really fleshed out. Because as I said, he's only in 10 episodes total and in the entire series. I mean, they're not really going to flesh out a real good story for him in 10 episodes. But they tried. But, but enough about that. Let's talk about this. Typical box affair. You got the 4 Plus logo there. Because she should be older than the age of four to play with this toy. <laughs> and I'm obviously older than the age of four, even though I don't act like that way sometimes. If you ask my dad, but we won't get into that. There's a reason you don't get talked about on this channel. One of these days I'll actually do a video and talk about that. But that won't be today. I've been on my high horse enough today. But you got Lightning Collection logo. You got the character name there. You got... The art picture there looks really cool. I mean, really cool. And then In Space logo there. What's with Hasbro not wanting to touch Power Rangers Turbo yet? I mean, come on. And of course, you got him holding the Turbo Navigator. Again, not going to say it. Because I don't know if he had a personal weapon or not. I cannot remember. I'd have to go back and watch the episodes he's in. I don't think he did. And of course, picture of him again. And let's get the box out of the way. Let's go with the figure and his accessories. The important stuff. Alright, so you got Phantom Ranger here. Who looks really awesome. And you can obviously see my arm right there. Ah! He just fell over. He is a little heavy. Well, he's got that armor style thing. Kind of like how the A-Squad does. I mean, he looks less airsofty than the A-Squad does, obviously, but... Yeah, there we go. That'll work. I'll have to lift him up a little, but yeah. You've got... He's got... His his spare hands are two fist. So, two punching hands, which... I mean, not really talk about much there. Alright, then he comes with that, as I said, a repainted version of the Turbo Navigator, which is painted pretty well, actually. I don't think this is his weapon, though, he uses in Turbo. Then he has two, count them, two effects pieces. He's got one for the blaster, 
which looks cool. And then he's got this one that looks like he got like attacked or something. Let's see if I can put it on him. It's the same one that the putties come with, which for them, it totally makes sense. Him, I'm not real sure. <laughs> but yeah. Looks kind of silly, but it works for him. And then, yeah, I don't know what's with the hole in his chest ruby there. That's the only thing I'd like to complain about. I did hear some people complain that this isn't gold. But I did do my own research, and apparently it is. In show shots, it does show it as silver, so that is correct. So that's good. His head, he can look up, he can look down. He can go all the way around. I better than Cassie was. His arm, he cannot go all the way around, but he can go up and back. He does not have the upper arm swivel. Okay, he does have that upper arm rotation that a lot, that a lot of the guys do. He's got the elbow joint, which is pretty loose. And then the hands, I don't... Yes, they can. They can move in and out. He does have an ab crunch. And of course he has the upper leg swivel. No, he does not. Yes, he does. He can't go all the way around because of the pad, his thigh pad here, but leg can go up. Leg cannot go back, but it can go out pretty well. He does have his double knees, like all lightning collection do. And of course, you know, he he can spin on his top of his boot. And of course, you know, you can adjust the feet. Overall, am I happy with this Phantom Ranger? Especially since it's my first ever Phantom Ranger figures I bought. Yes, it is. I wouldn't mind another one. And they actually have his chest ruby filled in. Because that's his power source. So a hole in his power source is kind of a problem. But yeah, so... So yeah, eventually, you know, maybe another release. Maybe a two-pack with Cassie and fix her paint issue I talked about. But overall, I, I like this figure. I mean, it's a very good figure. Definitely worth the collection. Now, am I going to put it when I make my big displays? Is it going to go in my, with my in-space stuff or my turbo stuff? It's going to go with my turbo stuff. But that's just me. You know? Maybe you might put it with your... Uh, and space stuff. It's just personal preference. But, alright, so that's all for me today. I'm going to hop on out of here. I'll catch you all next time. Well, we'll have more fun like always. This is Jack Rabbit hopping out.